In this week's Adventist News, SPD records highest baptism numbers despite COVID-19. Epauto enrollment reaches a high of more than 600 students and new appointments bring changes to the General Conference Office. Despite church closures and cancelled events, the South Pacific Division recorded its highest ever baptism number in 2020 and was the only world region to experience significant growth during the COVID-19 pandemic. The SPD recorded more than 49,000 baptisms in 2020 with almost 9,000 professions of faith, an increase of around 40% compared to the year before. This statistic defies a trend of decreasing baptisms worldwide with every division recording a decrease, except for the Southern Asia Pacific Division, which experienced a 0.5% increase. SPD President Pastor Glenn Townend attributes the division's success to the church's strong focus on the harvest cycle of disciple-making in Papua New Guinea and the Trans-Pacific Union. Speaking of progress, Apalto Adventist High School in Port Vila, Vanuatu, commenced its academic year with an enrolment of more than 627 students, an increase from 580 students last year. School principal Willie Luen explained that the school has created three streams for year 9 and 10 to better prepare students for year 10 national exams and their professional futures. In 2020, more than half of the school's Year 13 students were awarded scholarships and Apauto is aiming to do even better this year. The Worldwide Seventh-day Adventist Church appointed two new senior leaders during their recent spring meetings. The new appointments came after General Conference Executive Secretary G.T. Ng and CFO Juan Prestel Poisson announced their retirements. South American Division President Erton Kohler was elected the new Secretary of the General Conference and Paul Douglas, who was the Director of the General Conference Auditing Service since 2007, was elected CFO. You can read more about their professional profiles and new roles on our website. Well, that's all in this week's Record Wrap. As always, we hope you have a wonderful weekend and God bless.